Hello Irish fans and welcome to the start of the sixth year of our exclusive daily coverage of Notre Dame training camp here on UND.com. I'm Jack Nolan and as you can tell it's raining behind those gates at the LeVar practice complex. The Fighting Irish are on the field right now going through their first practice session of training camp 2011 and this is the way it's been for the last 25 minutes or so. It's been pouring during practice but as one coach said the rain makes you concentrate a little bit more and that's what the Irish are doing. Big deal all across the country the opening of practice you can see right over here you can see the satellite truck and the reason that is there some other media there as well is because ESPN and Joe Shad are going to be going live after the first practice session of the year for Notre Dame and of course this rain didn't stop our UND.com cameras we've got all the action that took place up to this point we've got a lot to show you I know you're very excited about seeing some of the newcomers and the veterans as well they're in shorts and helmets today and they're soaked but they're working hard so here's a look at the first practice of training camp for the fighting Irish football team the Irish began their preparations for today's first practice of training camp last night by sitting down to break bread at training table and then heading to Isbin Auditorium for a team I meeting. Uh, I need your attention. Uh, Before the Irish hit the practice field on Saturday, ESPN's Joe Shad was already live on Sports Center Saturday morning, letting Irish fans all across the country know Notre Dame was beginning fall camp today. Meanwhile, this afternoon, the team broke into position groups and headed to their respective meeting rooms in the Goog. Around 2.15, one of the student managers sounded the horn, <laughs> signaling the players that it was time to head to the locker room, grab their practice gear, and get dressed for practice. Under NCAA rules, helmets are the only protective gear the players are allowed to wear during the first two days of practice. Shoulder pads can be added for days three and four, and full pads are allowed on day five, which for the Irish will be next Wednesday. As you can see, it was not raining when the Irish took the field at 245 for the first practice of the season, but that quickly changed. The skies opened up and drenched everyone on the field. But the players and coaches kept working, and our crack UND.com staff kept shooting. So without further delay, here is an inside look at the first practice of the 2011 season for the Fighting Irish football team. Keep us in the building though. Yeah, he said what's good. <laughs> Keep us in the building. He's Spalding's in high school. That's him. Get those hands warmed up. Good. Ooh, that was something I've never seen before, Captain. Huh? I know the first player to the ball. That's it! 
Thank you. 